Fox SA News at 9, Puro San Antonio. Right now, the Texas drought is drying up just about everything, including revenue stream for businesses across our area that depend on water. Yeah, they say this summer is not off to a very good start and they're having to make some changes. Unfortunately, as Fox SA's Stephanie Ascavel explains, tubing businesses along the Guadalupe River say it's hard to even float down the river. The water dropping in the lake, it's running pretty low, so they're not releasing as much water. Um, when I first started here, it was running about 125 CFS, and right now it's about 63 CFS. Anthony Brown is the tubing manager at Rio Guadalupe Resort in New Braunfels. He says this is the lowest he's seen water levels at the Guadalupe River since he started working there five years ago. According to Brown, the drought has made it increasingly difficult to float down the river, and they've had to make big changes in the way they do business. That's why I try to keep the bottoms on our tubes now is to keep from people dragging their butts and stuff on the rocks. Staff at Rio Guadalupe Resort tell me because float times are taking almost twice as long as they used to, they're having to offer other alternatives for people who want to get in the water. Business is a little slower, um, but we have been letting people just day passes, just come and hang out at the river instead of float, and that has picked up. Deb has been enjoying the Guadalupe River her entire life. I've seen it lower than this. I've seen it higher than this. Um, it just depends on the year, really. She agrees that letting people hang out on the riverbanks is a better option than trying to go tubing if the water is too low. I mean, if it's too low where you're going to be walking the entire time and we'll just hang out at the river, just sit on the shore and enjoy that time. Stephanie Esquivel for Fox SA.